Hey guys, what's up? This is Koga Ninja, and I'm back with another video. And in this video, what we're going to do is I'm going to introduce you to a man named Travis McGee. This guy is amazing. Uh, one of the best crafts players I've ever seen, met. Uh, he is the creator of a product that re we released uh, about two years ago called the Trinity Method. It is the next step in the evolution chain for charting the game of craps. What we produced, there is nothing else like it in the world. We literally have kicked everyone's ass when it comes to a methodology for charting the game of craps and yes there are other methods out there but let me tell you this methodology kicks the shit out of all of that and the creator is here with us today in studio obviously he is in silhouette and the reason we got to keep his identity secret is because he's a real player and he's out there in the trenches almost every single day guys this is the real deal right here and so we got to keep him uh, in silhouette. We can't reveal who he is because the casinos will find out who he is. And uh, they will obviously put a stop to what he does. So let's talk about the Trinity Method. Uh, what Travis McGee has done with it. Uh, we've created a list of questions that have been thrown at us over the last two years. We're going we're gonna to break down each one of these questions so that you'll have a better understanding of what the Trinity Method is and how it will benefit you as a player. Now, for me, real simple, the reason that I, I uh, uh, wanted to do this project with, 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 with Travis was because if you're ever in a situation where you can't throw, you maybe have your arm broken or or uh, something's wrong with your throwing arm, but yet you still want to play the game of craps, this is, the, this is the methodology you want to use simply because you're not throwing, you're not controlled throwing, you're just recording what other people are doing with the dice. And let me tell you, this is an amazing, amazing uh, methodology. And so let's go ahead and get into it right now. Let's go ahead and throw out the first question to Travis McGee. And uh, we'll do a little intro with him as well. So who is the developer of the Trinity Method? Hello, fellow craps players. I am Travis McGee. I have been playing craps all over the world, mainly in the United States, but bounced to different parts of the world, playing craps for almost four decades now. And for the last almost dozen years, I have been analyzing and charting craps rolls to the four corners of the craps world and developing what we have called now the Trinity Method. And we have brought this to you over the past two years with the help of Koga Ninja to made it available for all craps players to use and win on the craps table. Okay, question number two for Travis. Travis, how long did it take you to develop this methodology? And I know we may have covered it a little bit, but I'm sure there's a couple extra things you might want to say. So how long did it take you to, to develop this methodology? The Trinity Method is an accumulation of work that has been tried and tested over the past dozen years and live casino play throughout American casinos and actually throughout the world. However, we've only brought it to the public commercially just these past two years, even though we've tried and tested it over the past dozen years. And in those dozen years, we have verified over 400,000 rolls that we've gone through and analyzed and given you the results of those 400,000 rolls of different casinos throughout the United States and the world to, so that we've broken it down into manuals and videos so that you can see the results and go to the tables with confidence to win with the Trinity Method. 
All right, question number three for Travis. In the Trinity method, uh, there's a new terminology that's gonna that is introduced, and that is which is known as negative indicators. And this is something that most craps players have never even heard of. So the question is, are the negative indicators listed in the Trinity method? video applicable only to the Trinity method bet or is there other ways of using it? No, not at all, Koga Ninja. The negative indicators listed in our instructional video applies to most any and all craps betting systems and betting methods. The negative indicators are derived from analyzing more than 400,000 live casino rolls over the past dozen years and are only listed in our video if their occurrence appears more often than the expected value and the variance is higher than the standard deviation. The expected value of a random variable is the mean of its probable distribution. The Trinity Method video teaches you how to observe the craps tables and recognize both positive and negative indicators. You will no longer be playing blindly like more than 90% of today's craps players that assume that every casino table is the same. Learning to recognize these negative indicators will probably save your bankroll more than tenfold the cost of the Trinity Method, even if you never make the suggested Trinity Method bet that we go over inside the videos. All right, question number four. For Travis, and the question is, does the Trinity method require any advanced mathematical skills? And I know that we are kind of doing something that's different here. And I know that that when you when you do this kind of stuff, people kind of, oh man, do I have the math skills for this kind of thing? So I know that that's been a question that has popped up kind of quite a few times. People are kind of, a, or you know are afraid of that because their math skills might uh, not be up to par. But let's hear what you have to say, Travis. Koga Ninja, no, not at all. The only basic math skills you need to know is counting to 12, really, which is the number of pips on the dice. Once the basic instructions in our Trinity Method instructional videos are known, as well as the videos in, in the owner's manual, you only use observation skills at the table. All right, we're moving along. Question number five for Travis. How long does it take to learn the Trinity method? Depending on your previous craps knowledge, on average about 25 to 30 hours of study to become proficient with this interactive Trinity method. This allows you to absorb the Trinity method so that it becomes second nature to you in the casino. This includes going over the five hours of video, plus the owner's manual that you receive, plus practicing it so that you know it second nature. Question number six for Travis McGee. When was the magic moment that you discovered the Trinity Method? That magic moment was when I was analyzing a database of roles from the craps table and noticed a subsequent pattern of winning bets occurring at an extremely high frequency in favor of the player at almost an 80% clip. After testing and refining the nuances of this Trinity method, my winning percentage now is over 88%. Question number seven, what is included with the Trinity method course? Koga Ninja, the answer to your question is, inside the Trinity Method course, you get instructional videos with over five hours of training from live casino data. That's 13 videos. You also get an owner's manual, including over 40 pages of instructional procedures and exhibits. You get unique digital charts, you also have a betting option worksheet, a casino checklist, and 
you also get lifetime technical assistance and support from the Trinity Method staff. Travis, question number eight for you. How long will it take you to recover the cost or your initial investment of the Trinity Method course? Koganinja, depending on your available bankroll and betting level, it can take as little as two casino sessions to recover your investment based upon the black chip suggested betting option. All right, question number nine. Travis, can you use the Trinity method on both a regular casino craps table as well as the popular uh, electronic craps or the bubble craps? A lot of people like to call it the popcorn craps machines. Yes, Kogan Ninja, definitely. The Trinity method has been proven on both the regular craps casino table as well as those new electronic craps tables. However, you need to be well aware that some of these electronic craps are just computers with artificial programmed intelligence to offset your bets. Verify that you are playing with true random electronic craps and not just pseudo random electronic craps. All right, question number 10, and this is a big one, uh, Travis, because everyone, you know, always asks this question, especially of me when, when you know, because I teach dice control, they're always asking, you know, what my winning percentage is, how many times do I win when I go out, you know, if I'm doing five sessions a week, you know, they're always wanting to know the question. So the question for you is, is what is your winning percentage? using the Trinity method. Koga Ninja, I win over 95% of my bets made with the Trinity method in live casino action. Now let me explain how that is done with our analytical numbers compared to what some of the other strategies that are being sold on the market. For instance, there is one very popular strategy that, that professes to be winning over hundreds of winning sessions in a row. Now, I have talked to some of their students. Some of their students have bought the Trinity Method, and they have told me that they have gone to live casino play with this person that's selling this strategy, and they use a type of Martingale system. Trinity Method does not use a type of Martingale. And they have gone into this casino with their students and they have lost in this casino and they keep losing in this casino whereas their students are there watching them play and playing with them and all of their students have lost their bankroll and the teacher of this strategy has lost his bankroll and finally he, he goes he leaves that casino with his students, goes to another casino, and makes the table limit bets and wins at that second casino and then goes and testifies that he has a winning casino session. And that's part of his 100 plus winning streak. Yet his students lost. They could not continue because they lost their bankroll at the previous casino. Yet he says that was a winning casino session. My fellow craps players, I do not believe that was a winning casino session. However, he puts in his records and counts as his analysis that that was a winning casino session. We do not monkey around with those kind of numbers. And we do not do that because our numbers prove with themselves and show with themselves that it works without that kind of massaging of the numbers, massaging of the casino sessions, stretching the definition of casino sessions between two different casinos, that we don't have to do that. Our method speaks for itself. So let me tell you how our method, the Trinity method, derives its winning percentages by giving you a sample play. For instance, in the casinos, this allows me 
the Trinity, by using the Trinity method, this allows me to win over 88% of my casino sessions. I define a casino session as going to a table, buying in at that table, and coloring up at that table, leaving that table. I win 88% of the time. Now, counting all the bets that I make, single bets on a roll, one roll, I win 95% of those bets. Let me explain how this is done. For instance, let's discuss a sample of 22 casino sessions that is very typical of my play. I'm looking at a streak of 22 straight winning sessions spanning over 30 hours of live casino play. That's 22 different casinos that took just 30 hours of play. This included the first 19 casino sessions produced a net winning payoff on every roll that a bet was made. How many times have you played craps and won a net payoff on every single roll you played? It's almost impossible in a craps casino play. That was the first 19 casino sessions. On my 20th session, I lost on one roll, but I had nine winning bets that still produced a net winning session at that casino. On my 21st session at a different casino, I lost on one roll, but I had 12 winning bets that still produced a net winning session. On my 22nd session, again produced a net winning payoff on every single craps roll bet that I made. Again, the summary, 22 casino sessions. I had 22 straight winning sessions over 30 hours. And that's very typical of our Trinity method owners. Once they become very proficient with the Trinity method, after just a little over 20 hours of studying, they, you too can come out and win with the Trinity method in live casino play. Now, how many craps players can walk away from one casino session and say they received a winning payoff on every dice roll bet? Yet the example I just showed you on the very first 19 sessions of this 22 example, I never lost a single bet in live casino action. I have only lost on two actual rolls of the dice in those 22 casino sessions, spanning over 30 live casino hours. Not many people can say that. Even this competitor that sells a strategy that says he's won over a hundred sessions in a row, his so-called sessions. He does not win every single bet. And the Trinity method also does not win every single bet, but it does win a lot more than it does lose over 95%. And that accounts for a winning session total of 88%. And Koga Ninja, that I hope it explains without getting too lost in numerical analysis, our winning strategy, our winning average. All right, number 11, question 11 for you, Travis. Here we go. Uh, can any other betting method or strategy be used in conjunction with the Trinity method? And I know that this is a big question because uh, we've seen it repeated over and over and over. And when you do this, when you do dice control and stuff, people are always wanting to know if you can mix it up, basically. So what, what do you say to that? Koga Ninja, yes. I have done so numerous times. And I know hard habits are hard to break <laughs> because people come in with their true and tried betting strategies and systems that they've used over the years and they're comfortable with 
And the Trinity method is very, very different. You're going to learn something that it's, it's like going to Craps University because you're going to learn something that's going to be with you for a lifetime. And, and you're going to want to fall back into some of your old habits. And that's fine. However, if you want to maintain that high winning percentage, you will soon learn to kind of throw away those old habits because they're not as high winning percentage. And that is why I now concentrate solely on the Trinity Method bet that we give to you in this Trinity Method course. Because the Trinity Method consistently produces a more stable, positive, return on investment and higher winning percentage compared to several traditional betting strategies. Simply put, using other betting strategies simultaneously often reduces the profit that you can earn on the Trinity Method bets. Question number 12. Does the Trinity Method involve any martingale or matrix type progression betting? Kogan Ninja, no. Absolutely not. The Trinity Method bet is a very straightforward betting method. Neither Martingale, nor Matrix, nor any similar mathematical-based progressions are suggested. Doing so would add too much volatility to an already mathematical advantage betting method. The Trinity Method avoids any dangerous gimmick-type betting systems like Martingale. If you go to Wikispaces and you, and you type in Martingale systems, you will see warnings all about martingales and how these are type of betting scams. So I would suggest that you you stay away from these type of betting scams that will just get you in trouble over time. And no, this is not the Trinity method is not a martingale type or progression type betting system or method. Question number 13, Travis. There seems to be rules written within the Trinity Method that are very different. How do we learn these rules? Koga Ninja, the concepts and rules of the Trinity Method are indeed unique and are best learned through practice. The Trinity Method techniques are not available to 99% of the craps players. The Trinity Method is a game-changing method of playing craps that is not discussed by casinos when they teach how to play or deal craps. And it's not available in any craps books that I know of. The rules are clearly explained in the Trinity Method seminar videos. Also included in our course materials is an owner's manual with clear instructions for the Trinity Method. Included separately in the Trinity Method package is a list of proven Trinity Method bets for various sizes of bankrolls, from red chip bettors to green chip bettors to black chip bettors, and a concise casino checklist for reviewing the rules before each casino session. Okay, number 14, Travis, question number 14. Is the Trinity Method just for betting on other players' roles, or can, it, can a controlled thrower also take advantage of their tosses and the Trinity Method? And that's a question we get a lot. We want we, we, you, we always get quite we always get the question: um, If I'm throwing controlled, is that going to mess up this whole Trinity Method thing? Can I use it in conjunction? Can I use them together? And obviously a lot of people think that you can't, but the reality is, is, is you can. So give me some more insight on that. Kogan Ninja, excellent question. There is a lot of theories out there about the left brain and right brain and too much analysis going on in these complicated charting systems and not being able to toss and analyze your charts at the same time. And so lots of charting systems on the market and craps tell you not to throw and this takes away a lot of the advantage 
very good dice controllers out there and and tell them to only bet on other uh, other throwers and other players at the craps table and that that's like playing with uh, one hand behind your back so the Trinity method does not do that it does not handicap you at the table unlike many of the more complicated charting strategies available on the market that tell you not to toss the dice while charting the Trinity method is flexible and simple enough to allow even the best dice tossers to increase their craps profits by using it simultaneously with their toss. All right, number 15, moving along, moving along. Okay, here we go, number 15. What are some of the disadvantages of the Trinity method, if there is any? Kogan Engine, the disadvantages of the Trinity method include, one, the low level of risk for the Trinity method bet does not meet most casinos' requirements for higher rated comps. And number two, the Trinity method requires a level of patience and discipline that most gamblers do not have. Number 16, question number 16 for you, Travis. Here we go. Uh, do, you have, do you have to bet large amounts in order to win with the Trinity method? Kogan Engine, no. There's a lot of systems being sold on the market that say you have to bet over $100 per bet or, or enormous amounts, otherwise don't buy their system. That is not true with the Trinity method. The Trinity method is flexible enough for red chip players or green chip players or the black chip players. Even high rollers can increase their craps winning percentage by using the Trinity method that tailored for their bankroll. Question number 17. In the video, you refer to a negative indicator as bookends. What do you mean by this? Ah, Kogan Ninja, that's a tricky question because you've seen and produced the video. But I'm not sure I'm ready to give that answer to the world yet. Not everybody. You have to buy the Trinity method for that answer. Actually, this is just one of the dozen of negative indicators revealed in the Trinity method from analyzing over 400,000 live casino rolls. Bookends refers to the numbers repeating 14 rolls later. This is especially prevalent with sevens, the devil, that occurs 14 rolls later at a frequency greater than random. This repeating action is nicknamed bookends due to, well, I'll have to let you buy the Trinity Method because that is revealed in the Trinity Method package. All right, that was it, guys. A uh, bunch of questions we threw out at uh, Travis McGee. I, I Kogan Ninja, want to say thank you so much for being here in the studio. Thanks for coming out. It was amazing having you. Uh, uh, and hanging out with you and answering, uh, having you answer all these questions. Uh, this Q and A was awesome. So, uh, Travis, give us a, give us a shout out. Uh, is there anything that you would like the craps community, the craps world to know? Uh, let's hear it and, uh, say goodbye to all the, the great, uh, students out there and, uh, we'll see you on the flip. Go for it. What do you got? Koga Ninja, thanks so much for allowing us to visit your crap studio. I just want to say to our fellow craps players around the world, thanks for having us in today and listening to us. The Trinity Method is something that will help increase your winning percentage at the table. We have over five hours of video and over a 40-page manual that once you become proficient at it, even if you never make one of our suggested Trinity Method bets, you will have a lifetime knowledge that you can take with you to every casino just with the negative indicators that we give you 
after analyzing over 400,000 roles over a dozen years that will help you increase your craps profits over tenfold the cost of the Trinity method. And that alone is, is like going to a craps university. Again, thanks so much craps players for listening and wish you luck at the tables. All right, guys, that's it. Thank you so much, Travis. Uh, for all you guys out there that are watching this video, for more information on the Trinity Method, go down into the video descriptions. Into the video description, all the links will be there to all of the products that I sell. Uh, if you want to come out and do a training with me, uh, hit me up all the information will be below i'm still doing my seminars i'm still doing my one-on-ones um also www.koganinjadicecontrol.com you can go there get all the information about me uh all of my products that i sell if you want to if you want a t to attend a seminar or do a private one-on-one -on -one with me. All the information's there. Reach out to me, koganinja777 at yahoo.com. That's the fastest way to get a hold of me. All right, guys, that's it for this video. We'll see you on another one. Thanks a lot.